What's up YouTube, David with Milehead Campers coming back at you again with another video. Today, we've got an unboxing and installation video on an eBay chrome grill inserts for a 2011 to 2016 Ford F-250 or F-350. So that's what we've got here. This is gonna be the other four inserts that I need to make the front of my F-250 look like it's got the chrome grill, the factory chrome grill. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, get this thing open and see what it looks like. As always guys, be sure to look in the description below. I'll have links to everything in this video in the description below. See how it's packaged here. Looks pretty good, right? Well, as you can see, it's going to be installing with uh, this 3M double back adhesive. Looks like from the factory, uh, they didn't do a perfect job of putting it on there, but oh well. So if we flip it over, eh, the chrome looks pretty good. I don't know if you can see it that well on the camera there, but the shine on it's pretty good. It's fairly thick. It'll be interesting to see if the uh, double adhesive tape really works. That's <laughs> one of the things I'm most curious about. So, and here's the other one. Of that one. Go ahead and get these set off to the side and take a look at the main pieces here. So packaging it looks pretty good. Uh, none of the chrome looks damaged so far. Not a very good job from the factory right here. It's actually, I don't know if you can see it, but it's coming off of the grill already. So, And like I said, that is the one thing that I'll be curious to see how well this tape actually does. But anyway, the chrome looks decent. Okay, so with that said, let's get ready for the install. So for the first step here, guys, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna clean the surface here of where we're gonna be putting our new chrome caps. And I'm gonna be using denatured alcohol. Please use whatever you're comfortable with as far as what you wanna to use to clean the plastic. And the idea here is just to get the surface nice and clean so that the, the tape that's on the back side of the caps will stick to this surface with no issues. Be sure to check out all of our RV slide decals on our website as well as our all new children's book series, Scamper and the Camper. Links in the description below. Okay, once you've got it all cleaned up, uh, we're gonna go ahead and start installing the caps. After I attached the inserts with the adhesive tape, I decided to add eight small screws in these locations, just to try to make sure that the inserts don't fall off. I first drilled a small hole, and then I snugged down the screws. I tried to put the screws in places where they would be hard to see. Okay, so here's the final product. As you guys saw, it was really easy to install, and in my opinion, it looks really good. I'm very happy with it, but let's see what it looks like after a couple years. And here are the inserts three years later, guys, and you can see they still look pretty, pretty good. Um, and I've done multiple trips to Wisconsin, Arizona, so it's, it's had some travel on it. And um, really the worst is probably right there, a little rock chip. But other than that, it's held up just as good as the, the factory ring right there. So, not bad. That's three years later. Be sure to smash that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you get notified when I upload new videos. Don't forget to hit that like button, and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace.